Hi guys, good morning. This is Riza here. I'd like to wish you all a very Merry Christmas. As you can see, I am again at my favorite spot, Daytona Beach, Florida. I'm here to visit my son and my grandson, and I thought I would pull some cards for you guys for Christmas. So, what do we have here? First card that we got for today is the Ace of Wands. This is the Botticelli deck. It's very, very beautiful. It has a lot of pictures of artworks in the background, so I am in love with this deck as well as all my other decks. But for Christmas, I thought I should uh, break this one out for you. This here is a rendition of the Archangel Michael bringing Mother Mary the news that she is carrying the baby Jesus and a wand. The beginning of a creative venture of passion, of a passionate path. So for all of us listening to this channel, there's something that's going to be announced to us this week or within the next couple of days that's going to be very creative, very passionate. It's going to bring some good news into our lives, some inventive news, something that we can work with something that's going to set us perhaps on a new path. The second part that I got for us today, my dear YouTube family, is the Two of Wands. So, apparently this new creative venture that we are going to hear about or that's going to be told to us or someone is going to come with, with a new plan, with a new venture that perhaps we might want to join them, it's going to um, throw us off balance a bit because then we're going to realize that we have two paths. Should we change the path that we're on? Should we take this venture on? We will need to reflect on our abilities whether we can go on this new venture, whether we should step out and do something different, step out of our comfort zone. Because it proves to be a positive venture but a bit unstable as it it'll be something that we haven't done it'll be a new path a new person a new situation a new home for all of us it'll be something different but definitely something because for the past few days I have been getting this card and I have even thought of it I even opened a book and it came out to this page so it was a message that the angels did want me to bring to you guys one way or the other so I figured I'd pull cards and lo and behold I got the same ones again. I also pulled a card from the Mother Mary deck to see what she would have to advise us. And we got the prayer card. So Mother Mary is telling us to pray. Pray for guidance, for a message to come because this new venture may throw us off guard but with prayer we'll be able to see the light, we'll be able to see the best way to move forward with this new decision that we'll have to take. Instead of worrying, I pray about this situation to bring about real solutions. So no need to worry about the situation that you're in, or for each of us it'll be something different. Perhaps something is weighing down on us. Again, Christmas sometimes brings about uh, some painful memories or regrets or decisions that we wish we could have done a little bit differently but we need to pray and we need to raise our vibrations and send it off to God because mostly we're learning lessons while we're here on earth so we need to kind of let go and let God this new venture perhaps that you're setting yourself on or that someone will come and announce something new to you perhaps you should take it first meditate a bit on it pray a little bit on it but some sometimes something different really helps us in life. It gets us out of our rut, gets us out of our head, it gets us out of a situation that perhaps we're not very comfortable in, but we could use a little a little distraction, something a little different. So I would say go for it guys. Know that I love you. I'm sending you lots of love from my heart all the way to yours. In the background there you can see the beach. You can also see that there's cars out there. So here in Daytona Beach you're allowed to drive onto the beach and set up right next to your vehicle so you don't feel that separation anxiety that you have to walk a mile to get to the ocean. <laughs> For some people they really like that. I would prefer the beach a little bit more private but hey you can't have everything. As you can see it's tied low. So it's way out there. This morning it was a little higher. It was a bit closer, but it has gone out in the last few hours. 
know that I love you guys and I will probably be posting some more of these mini videos within the next couple of days as I will be in Daytona till Sunday. So my weekly reading will come from here as well. I love you guys. Have a wonderful and blessed day with your family, with your friends, neighbors, or just chilling and meditating on your own. Bye now.